I got the acre and I this now. It's not in the class, I'm in the lab. You know, today we are going to do the activity based learning. Come on, we just will go and show you the lab. So, see, today we are in the. Come on, my friends. Just see which lab it is. Do you know? Yes, it is chemistry lab. Yes. When, when, whenever you are in the lab, you should. Water. The oil has not dissolved in the water. 
water. So such a liquids are called as the immiscible liquid. The such a liquids are called as the immiscible liquids. Now they have some now gaseous. The next phase of matter is gaseous in water. Do you like a cold drink? Now see, this is a cold drink. Yes, no. If when you open the lid of that cold drink, you will see some bubbles. Am I right? The bubbles are coming out. Am I right? Yes or no? So these bubbles are nothing but like which are they are in the form of gas. We say that bubbles are nothing but carbon dioxide. They are nothing but carbon dioxide, which is in the gaseous form. So there are some. Gas which easily get dissolved in the water. For example, now see when you go for the swimming in the water, the there is a more percentage of oxygen. Now fishes, fish can easy, uh, easily swim in the water because they take the oxygen which is dissolved in the water. Are you getting? So these are some states of matter which easily get dissolved in the water. Now the next is expansion and contraction. For this, we are going to do the activity of ball and ring, which is shown in your textbook. For but before that, see when you heat any substance, when you heat any substance, the size of that particular substance get increases. That is that process is called as an expansion. Are you getting? For example, now see when you are when you will step up jar. And if it is very tight, your mother put some hot water because as soon as you put the hot water in on that, the lid of that the jar get expanded. Means the size of that it get increases. Are you getting? Why so? So for this contraction means when you uh, when you pour that particular substance, when the substance after heating it is cooled, it get contracted and the size of that jar. Size that size of that particular substance decreases. So we will start with the activity of ring and ball. Okay. Now we will start with the activity of expansion and contraction. Now see, this is what ring and this is a ball. Now we will see first whether the whether the ball is going easily. No, the ball is not going easily inside this ring. Am I right? So for this, we have to heat this ring. Now see, when I will heat this ring, this is a burner. Okay, you have to heat it properly. When you will heat this, now see. When I will heat this, now you, now if you will see this, the ball is going easily. Am I right? The ball is going easily. Why the ball is going easily? Because this the ring has increases the size of that part, and now when I will cool it, now see when when I will cool this, now we will see whether the ball is going again or not. Now we will see. The ball is going no. Why? Because after cooling, the size of the ring is decreased. The size of the ring is decreased. So. The ball cannot pass through it. Okay, have you understood about the expansion and contraction of the solid? So just see first board from. Now see, during expansion, when we heat a substance, the size of the particular substance increases. By during contraction, the When we cool the particular substance, the size of that substance get decreases. I hope you 